Hello, everybody. Rex Tempest, time traveler. I. Uh oh. Did I. What did I do? Oh, okay, nothing. Anyway, I am hanging out here on this crazy flat world. And. Okay, that's enough craziness. Because it's the world that's crazy and flat. Not me. Although, I guess I am a little bit flat, aren't I? Anyway, anyway, that's beside the point. Uh, today, we're going to be preparing and possibly starting a long journey. Uh, for any of you who've been watching, you know that I've been trying to build another portal. And because I do not have any obsidian anywhere naturally in this world, uh, what I've been having to do, plus there's no lava anywhere. Um, I mean, the only two places I could think where there might be lava, of course, blacksmiths, which we've been using. And, um, you know, there's a stronghold somewhere around here, so... They usually have lava, like, right next to the, uh, the end portals, but, uh, I have not found... Oh, come on. No. All right, hold on. Let's see if I can take out this guy. And I have got to put, like, some kind of a door on my, on my cave down there. All right. Anyway, um, yeah, so I can't even, uh get the nether, wait, no, what is it? The blaze powder to make an eye of ender to find the end portal, which is probably somewhere about 600 blocks in some direction. I don't know exactly. Um, and it would be underground, so it's kind of hard to find it. So I've been collecting lava. I have like two blacksmiths over in that town, two blacksmiths over in that town, and I've taken what lava I could, and that I didn't accidentally destroy. I've been building part of another portal, so I still need two more blacksmiths, because I need three more pieces, of, or three more sources of lava. Uh, so that's what I'm going to do today. I'm going to go and get some more uh, lava. Oh, all right, I was actually doing that for a reason. Uh, you know, actually, I think I'm going to get, instead of just three sources of lava, I think I'm going to get four. And that's because I also don't have any stone naturally occurring in this world. So this will allow me to create a cobblestone generator. All right, so, uh, oh, that's right. Yeah, there were a few things I wanted to do first. Um, things that, you know, will help me out. Well, the first one will help me out, and that is to create a compass. And the reason I wanted to create that is because that way, I mean, I'm not next to spawn, but I can first go to spawn you know, by, and make a trail back, and then um, I can use that to find my way back after I'm done with my journey. All right, so the second one is a clock, and uh, it, yeah, I'm a time traveler. I have to have clocks. Let's see, where's the sun at right now? Oh, okay, I started this kind of late in the day, didn't I? All right, uh, there are a few more things that I need um, and in order to get those. Uh, let's see, okay, yeah, I'm ready for that. And, hmm, do I, all right, I'm going to have to run to the farm real quick. I'm going to take this with me just so wherever I happen to need to sleep, I will be able to. And I'm going to run with the clock in my hand just because, you know, it's a clock. And, again, I'm a time traveler. Although, to be fair, I haven't done much time traveling, and at least, you know, not here. So, all right. Let me just collect some wheat. Um, and as always, my policy is to not just take the wheat, but to always replant. That way, no matter what happens, you know, I always have lots of food available. Okay, um, I guess I could have just left the bed over there since I'm probably just going to lay it down there anyway. And then go to get a quick nap and finish the last part of my preparations for traveling. <sighs> Z. Oh, okay. All right, you know, I'm going to leave that bed there because what I am going to do is I am going to take this bed. Now, the question is, can I get it without actually opening the gate? Maybe not. Okay. This cow decided to come in here, and now he's trapped. So... All right, let's go ahead and get ourselves a little bit armored up. Now, as far as the food I was collecting, um, hmm. Oh, okay, I do have two chickens in here. All right, 
So you will get some food, and you will get some food. And then as far as wheat, um, you will get some wheat, and you will get some wheat. Now, I know this is going to seem cruel, but first of all, I have a reason because... Oh, sorry. Oh, wow, I, I'm missing so badly. Ah, okay. I had to get the achievement first of all, because that is one of the challenges, is try to get every achievement. And... Also, I needed some special items. Now, hmm, I don't know. Do pigs reproduce with wheat? No? All right. Well, that's okay. I don't really need to kill any, and I would rather not if I don't have to. So, all right. Um, here, let me see if this will help you guys out. Nope. Let's see. Oh, sparkly! Uh, okay, I guess I didn't do anything. It made the cow sparkly, though. All right. Um, yeah, oh, right. I do need some of this. And, okay, where are we going with this? Um, right, right, okay, to the crafting table. So I need to do like this. Oh, what, no, and, oh, there we go. Three pieces of paper. And then we take the paper. I think, is it like this? We get the book. We take the, oh, Ah, hmm, that's right. We need squids. Because um, I was going to make like a book and quill, and I forgot you need the ink for it. So, hmm, guess I'm going to have to make this thing a little bit deeper. Will that be enough? Um, maybe. Sometimes, yeah, that's all it takes. And let's see. Well, why be faster if I'm just up here? Oh, yeah. So I guess it's not till you actually sink down to that level where things like that can happen. Where I'm sorry, I'm thinking where it slows down the uh, speed with which you can mine stuff. So I wonder if that'll be deep enough to make a uh, squid spawn. I really don't know the conditions other than you know water. Um, hmm. You know, what? I'm gonna try something else. I, oh, I don't have it with me. Uh, you know, uh, I was going to get my water bucket, but I'll just fill up one of these. And maybe running water will help. I mean, I don't know, again. But, uh, well, we got it pretty deep. And we got a nice area. Um, got some nice running water, so maybe if we, like, leave and come back, we'll have a squid. And so that we can get some ink. Alright, so let's go ahead. Um, what, what can we do that's close by where we don't have to go too far away? I don't know. Um, let's uh, let's put this here. Oh. Uh, um, yeah, okay. Let's, let's cook some of this for the heck of it. Um, hmm. Wow, that was... Uh, that was really kind of a large part of my plan was being able to get some of that. And I, I realize that sometimes I really haven't thought things through fully. Like, um, for instance, uh, one of the achievements, I cannot... Um, oh, whoops. Uh, there. Get, get out of my hand, sorry. Um, yeah, like I said, I need some to bring in some help for some of the achievements. So, you know, I gotta do that. Oh, what if I make a cake? Uh, that will have me kind of move in a little bit back and forth. Um, but again, I'm trying to get some achievements here. So, uh, excuse me, Mr. Cow, or Mrs. Cow, I'm sorry. Okay, I have my, oh wait, that's right. It's three buckets of milk, isn't it? Um, sorry, little, I need some of that. Okay. Uh, you know what? Since you guys are loose anyway, it'll just be, I think, faster to do that and just reproduce you than it would be to try to, uh, you know, get you back inside. All right. Um, oh, and I am getting nice and hungry. Uh, no squids yet, but we are still pretty close. So I may have trouble spawning them in. And let's see. 
this will be exciting if this is if I have what it what I need. So let's see. Uh, what the? Oh, that's right. Uh, I gave all my grains to the baby cow. So or all the wheat. So I got to go and get some more wheat. Um, and then we will go from there. All right. Let's see. So let's go ahead and collect all this wheat. And okay, do I have it all? Uh, some of it. Oh, there's always that one piece that goes flying off in a different direction. Um. All right. So let's see. Let's uh go ahead. Yes. Replant. Replant. Okay. All right. So I have my wheat, I have my three things of milk, I have my two things of sugar, and I have my eggs. So now all I need is to get to the crafting table over here. Um, and, oh, I am nice and hungry, so once I have that cake, I'll be able to eat the whole thing. So let's see. Bucket, bucket. Uh, oh, there's my egg. And there is some of the wheat. And... Yay! Woo! Another achievement down! Alright, so, uh, oh, throw my buckets on the floor. Let's see, I need to, oh, you know what? I am going to just make myself a quick little eating surface right here. Um, and I'll put the cake down. And hop, hop, yep, whoops, hop, yep, yep, hop, yep, yep, ah. Oh, that was good, and it it really did take care of my hunger, so. All right, uh, you know, I think what I will do, though, is for now, I am going to head towards the spawn, like I said, and just kind of put a little bit of a trail, and that way, like, when I do go off, I can use the compass to get back to spawn, and then from there, of course, I can get back home. At least that's my hope. So let's see. Uh, let's take our, take it through here. Yeah, I haven't been back to spawn since I came here. I know that there is a chest over there, so that'll be good. Um, and let's see. Hello, where, how far did I have to go? I don't remember now. It's been a little bit of a while since I first came into this world. And honestly, like I said before, everything just kind of looks the same after a while. So, oh, that little piece of uh, cyan wool kind of floating in the air. All right. Now, I did leave the bonus chest. I left the, uh, the torches around it. So I would hope that I, you know, before too long, I'm going to see that stuff. Wow, I really did travel a lot farther than I expected, didn't I? Um, you know, maybe I'll have to go back and look at the first episode and see what is it that drove me to go in that direction at all. Okay, there's the chest. Uh, but I just realized I'm not out here and I did not actually take my bed like I said I was going to at the beginning of the episode. Uh, fortunately, I mean, I do have some, uh, some wood. So I can just set up like a little quick, uh, all right, let's see, uh, probably two there, uh, make another crafting table, put it down on the ground, and take in some more of this wool, and there we go, oh, I did have a, I'm not making any more beds, I have like, what now, it's, Several in my pocket? Okay. Oh no. Things already did spawn in. So, let's see. Oh, alright. Well, maybe I'll at least get some, uh, oh, I got a potato. Is it? Oh yeah, just regular old potato. Half expected it to be rotten. Now the good thing is, I do need arrows. So, you know, that part, you know, this will help me out. And let's are like that. Wait, is that an Enderman over there? There's a few. Okay. All right, come on. I'm looking you right in the eye. What are you going to do about it? Huh? Yeah? What? Yeah. Come on.
Uh, come on. All right. You. You there. Quit, quit running away from me. I'm going to try and avoid this creeper. That's right. I'm looking you in the eye. And get out of here, creeper. Uh, I don't want you. I want him. Where'd he go? Okay. Come back here. Uh, and I'm getting hungry to top it off. Okay. Come on. Get some food. Oh, there you go. Oh, and I have to come over here. Oh, wow. I didn't realize how low my health had been getting. Uh, come here. Come here. I could try and fire an arrow towards him, but come on. Would you just hold still? That's right. Anything? Why are you guys not giving me ender pearls? How am I supposed to find a stronghold without one? Oh, these endermen of mine are so stingy. Oh, trying back away so you don't blow up. Okay. Well, thank goodness I have plenty of gunpowder that I can't do much with. Um, you know what? I'm just going to leave this here. And that way, the next time I'm in the area, I can camp. Maybe I, maybe I should build like a little structure like Oh, hello, traveler who's, you know, probably not going to come that often. Here's a little place to stay, and this is how you get to my home. Or maybe a rail car system would be good. Um, oh, that's right. I was going to write down the coordinates, and then I just realized I don't have any way to do that. I mean, I guess I could do a screenshot, but I don't know. That just, that seems late. All right, so let's head back to home. And let's kind of see where we stand on the whole getting ready to go thing. Uh, hopefully by then some uh, squid will have spawned in. Because certainly this, these little lakes aren't going to do the trick. So we'll see how my plan goes. And there comes the town on the horizon. It's always kind of weird how like, it forms things. I mean, I know why it does that. But it's like, oh, it's hazy. And oh, look, a new part of the building popped up. Um, you know, you, I'm just going to shear. Let's see, wait a second. Um, oh, I have no string whatsoever. Damn. That's not going to work. Uh, someday I would like to actually have some sheep that are, um, you know, in my pen, and I'll probably have to expand the barn and the farm and all that, but, uh, yeah, uh, definitely it's not going to happen today. So, uh, let's see, anything? Please be a squid, please be a squid. Um, squids, uh, no. Hmm. I wonder if they just need more room, maybe? Maybe if I combine these two, I'll get, like, you know, enough room to, uh, for a squid to spawn in and make it a little bit deeper. All right, that's I'm committed to this idea of making this squids appear. Um, also, I need to fix this water problem so that I can actually move around. So, oh, oh, it only took one thing of water. Okay. Um, hmm. Now let's uh, let's try mining this down. And as long as my mouth isn't underwater, I guess I can still sort of mine at high speed here. So, yeah. And axe to take care of the various pumpkins and stuff. Make, if nothing else, I get a nice big pool out of it for reflections and things like that. All right, let's just uh, collect some of this stuff. And I don't know, it took me such a long time to get to the surface. All right. So let's see, where are we at now? Um, ah, still not really any closer, it feels like, to taking off here. I mean, I have most of the stuff I was hoping for, but okay, come on. Let's get this. 
and up. Okay. Sorry, I'm not really talking much. There's not much I can say because I, mean, I already told you what I'm trying to do. And, you know, the game is just not cooperating. So, hmm. I guess I'll just think of something else. I mean, I guess I could just record the coordinates um, or something like that. Uh, like in the real world is what I meant. But uh, one thing I will do on here is whoa that was a oh now that I thought about think about it, why did I even need to collect those things hmm what don't I need probably not this many seeds I would imagine okay all right so let's go back here and we're going to try and do we're going to try and be productive in some way with this episode um, you know I'm just going to put these in here for now probably pull these out and I can get rid of those buckets um, let's go ahead and put this in here uh, no not really anything else mm. all right all right uh, you know what I need I need a storage room so that's something I'm gonna have to work on here fairly soon um, yeah see there's more bones uh, tracks and stuff mm. Anything good in here? Ah! Okay, well, the only string I have seems to be from the cobwebs, which, honestly, I could probably get rid of. Um, so let's put this there and there. And is it just one piece of string per? Okay, so I need to get... Mm, that's right here they are. Okay. So if I do this, uh, whoops, not that. And then I attack it with my sword, I get the string, and then, okay, okay. I'm doing really good here, because I finally have a way to really collect the animals well. I can't believe I didn't think of this earlier either. Uh, whoops, no, that's not what I want. I need to get some slime balls. Um, I have got to get rid of this water. So, hold on. Sorry, I know I'm kind of all over the place today, but this is how it usually goes. All right, so let's uh, get rid of the buckets. Just, yeah, there we go. Not the buckets, just the water inside. All right, all right, so now let's go over here and let's do this. Uh, gotta remember, gotta remember. Oh, here we go. Yeah, all right. Now let us put one of them in this chest, as well as all this stuff. Um, hmm. Yeah. All right. So let us find. I think there's sheep was somewhere over here. What was it? It was it despawned. I hope not. Oh, nope, there it is. There it is. Okay. All right. Sheep, come back here. And there. All right. Come on. Come on, little sheep. That's right. Oh, now I can at least feel like I got something out of this episode. Aside from a yummy cake. So, oh. I just realized um, you will not grow your wool back until I get you into a place that actually has grass. So I definitely need to put up a fence somewhere that has grass and probably be nice to put the other animals with the grass as well. So, but for now I'm just going to put you in here with the others just so you can hang out. Come on. Come on, little sheep. Ah, this way. Oh, it worked. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I forgot you have to go over that side. No. In. No. No, 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 no. Come on. Come on. And there. 
Ha! I have a sheep! Yay! Alright, let me just do a quick... Uh, let me just go to bed here real fast, and... Okay. Um, yeah, I went to bed, and then I had to stop recording. But, anyway, um... Uh, still no squid. Uh, I'm going to work on this a little bit, probably in between the episodes. Uh, but I definitely want to say thank you guys for watching, and I will see you next time on this crazy flat world. Woo! Bye. Uh...